Undoubtedly you know this five-pointed star. And you do not know that this five-pointed star has been one of the most important and sacred symbols in human history. This star in every ancient culture, from the Persian Empire, Ottoman, India, China, Greece, and Egypt to the Maya have been very important. It has even appeared on the walls of Neolithic caves and in Babylonian paintings. This star even plays an important role in different religions. Everywhere in Christianity, Islam, It is even seen in Buddhism. But the true nature of this five-pointed star has changed dramatically in recent decades. So that this symbol has a sinister reputation today. But why? We now introduce you to a shocking fact. First of all, you should know that this star is made up of five points through which a continuous line passes. And today the star is known as the pentagram, which is a Greek word meaning five borders. The oldest known pentagrams are about 5,500 years ago on the plateau of Iran, which can be seen from 46 inscriptions and lithographs discovered in this area. In the ancient Persian civilization, four stars were important. Each time each of these stars appeared in the sky, people knew it was a sign of change in life. These four stars were known as royal stars and today people know these stars as the four royal stars of Persia. The ancient Iranians believed that the sky was divided into four parts, each of which was protected by one of these stars, which were called mystical guardians. They viewed the skies not only because of climate change but also for calculating time and predicting the future. They named the four stars Tascator, which guarded the eastern sky and marked the beginning of the vernal equinox. Vanan, guards the northern sky and marks the beginning of summer. Satvis, guardian of the western sky and marks as the beginning of autumn. And Hafterang, named the guardian of the southern sky and marked as the beginning of winter. Undoubtedly, we accept and understand the existence of the metaphysical dimension of astronomy. An ethical analysis of the word metaphysics itself reveals that the human imagination is stimulated when looking at the night sky. The ancient Iranians respected the sky, seasons and elements as a way of life. These people knew the time of planting, growing, harvesting, hunting and resting through the stars. They glorified plants, water, soil, and rocks, and in fact saw the essence of God in everything because their wisdom knew that everything was interconnected and that nothing belonged to them. They showed the four royal stars that created this cycle in their lives in the form of a five-pointed star. The higher star was a sign of the nature of God, that is, the spirit of nature, man and animals. This belief was still respected by Iranians until Pythagoras acknowledged that these five points are a symbol of the five constituent elements of human, which in turn are the symbol of the human soul, soil, air, water and fire. After Jesus Christ, Christians called this spirit as the Holy Spirit and considered the five-pointed star sacred. But the importance of this five-pointed star is not limited to what we have said. The pentagram contains a golden ratio, a symbol of beauty and perfection. The pentagram is also closely related to the number five, which plays an important role in our world. And of course, the ancients believed that this five-pointed star was a powerful symbol to protect against evil. The star was also used to boost positive energy in a person or environment.
Thus, the five-pointed star was still considered sacred until it entered Kabbalah and then pentagram was used for alchemy during the Renaissance. Renaissance ritual wizards refer to the pentagram as a microscope of the human body. They believed that just as the pentagram could bring the human soul closer to God and boost positive energy, the opposite can also happen. But it was 1897 that Stanislaus de Guida turned the pentagram upside down, and officially published in his book, The Key to Black Magic, and he officially used this star for magic. The five-pointed star was then used in Wicca. Wicca is also referred to as pagan witchcraft, which is actually the modernized pagan religion. Wicca ritual began in the first half of the 20th century in England. And in 1954 by Gerald Gardner was introduced to the public. Anton LaVey was an American writer and musician who founded the Church of Satan in 1966. Over the years, he wrote several books describing Satan, perhaps the most infamous of which is the Satanic Bible, and he printed the symbol of inverted pentagram on the book. He then registered this symbol as the official logo of the Church of Satan. In this case, the symbol of the spirit, which has long been a symbol of the essence of God, was placed at the lowest point, that is, under the four material elements. In Freemasonry, the pentagram is referred to as the shining star of the morning, which we explained in the article The Secrets of Freemasonry. But this was not the only influence of Satan on the sacred. In the 8th century AD, Pope Gregory III named November 1st as Halloween, which means the Day of All Saints. The night before, October 31st, people prayed for the forgiveness of the Christian dead. The origins of this ceremony go back to the Celtic people. Halloween was brought to the United States by Irish immigrants, and then spread to other parts of the world. As people around the world prayed and celebrated this day for the forgiveness of their dead, As mentioned earlier, Anton LaVey founded the Church of the Satan in 1966. He described some rules to his followers. He declared October 31st as a day of worship for Satan. This celebration coincided exactly with the celebration of All Hallows Day of Christianity, namely Halloween. Thus, the demon worshippers infiltrated this ritual, and this ritual gradually lost its original nature so that most of the participants in Halloween ceremony do not know who is their host. It's another day to live another fairy tale It's another night to drink and then forget One of the beliefs of Halloween night is that if a single girl walks in front of a mirror with a candle in the middle of the night, she will see her future husband. But she actually sees the devil in the mirror. It's in the book of stars, the dusky twilight in the eye. Shadows of our lives dancing in the pool they rise. Oh, no. tomorrow.